Oh my gosh, these bags are heavy. As you guys can tell, I did a lot of damage at Bath and Body Works the other day. Why you gotta go like so tough, baby, when I call? Hey guys, what's up? It's Taylor and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a Bath and Body Works semi-annual sale haul. Now I asked you guys the other day on my Instagram story if you guys wanted to see this video and I got like 55 votes and only one of them was for no. So I just thought that I would do this video and I literally did so much damage at Bath and Body Works. Like I literally got two of these bags full of stuff and it's filled to the top. And also here is my receipt guys and look how long my receipt is. Like, oh my gosh, this is actually crazy so yeah as you guys can see i definitely did a lot of damage it actually makes me laugh seeing how long this receipt is because it just shows how much money i actually spent so yeah as you guys can see i love bath and body works and we're just gonna go ahead and get started with this haul because i have a lot of stuff to show you guys okay so the very first things that, that i got were these two body washes and these are just men's body washes and you guys are probably thinking taylor you're not a man why did you get these these are actually a father's day present for my dad and father's day is coming up and these were like half off and they were originally at 12.50 and i got them for 6.25 i really hope that my dad's not watching this video because you know i'm showing the gift that i got him for father's day so yeah um dad if you're watching this then you already know what you're getting and i'm really sorry but yeah anyways the first body wash that i got is this white citrus for men and it's a two-in-one hair plus body wash so you can also use this on your hair and then i also got the white water rush two-in-one hair plus body wash for men and i love the white citrus scent so that's why i got this one and i had never seen this blue one before and it smells really good and i can definitely see a man using this okay so i also picked up some soaps and i just got three and by the way these are just the antibacterial foaming hand soaps they have other ones but i like the foaming ones a lot better the other ones have the beads in them and my mom likes those a lot better but i like the foaming ones a lot better just because i feel like they get your hands more clean and these were originally 650 and i'm not sure how much they were on sale i have to look on the receipt okay they were originally 650 and and I got these all for three dollars each so i got three hand soaps for nine dollars which is definitely a steal okay so the first one that i got is an oh happy day and this is a pink grapefruit pop foaming hand soap and oh my gosh you guys i smell this in the store and it just smells so good it literally just smells like grapefruit. So yeah, if you guys like the smell of grapefruits, then I definitely recommend getting this scent because it definitely smells like grapefruit. The next one that I got is Georgia Peach. And if you guys know me, then you guys know that I love peach scents. And Georgia Peach from Bath & Body Works is probably like one of my all-time favorite scents. I don't know why but it just smells so sweet and so delicious and i really want to eat it but obviously i'm not going to because it's a soap and i would die if i ate it so yeah i'm not gonna do that and the very last one that i got is fresh lemonade and you guys know i love lemonade anything and this one's probably like my all-time favorite one i really want to smell this one and i can't get it open so i guess i'm not gonna smell this one but i already know it smells good because it's lemonade okay so i also picked up this watermelon lemonade shower gel and i also got the body cream and i love the packaging of this because i love watermelon so much it's probably like my all-time favorite fruit and my mom told me whenever we were at bath and body works that this scent is new and that's why i've never seen it before and oh my gosh you guys i just love the packaging of this so much this scent literally just smells like watermelon lemonade obviously but yeah like this scent just smells so good and it's so heavenly and if you guys like watermelon then i definitely recommend getting it it just reminds me of summer okay so these body Body creams were originally $13.50 and I got them for half off so I got them for like $6.75 and you guys know I love their body creams so much like they're so thick and so moisturizing and I hate their lotions just because they're so runny and I feel like they don't do anything for your skin okay so the shower gels are originally $12.50 and I got them for $6.25 so they were half off as well which usually they have some for like $3 but I didn't see any of those so I just settled for this deal I also got the body 
body cream and the shower gel in the scent Endless Weekend. And this scent reminds me of summer. I think this came out like last year, the year before. But yeah, like I said, I love their body creams and their shower gels and I'm really excited. And also look how cute the packaging on this is. Like, doesn't it just remind you of summer? And it just makes you want to go to the beach. Like this one is a picture of the beach. And then this one is a picture of people driving to the beach. And it just makes me want to go to the beach. But sadly, I have to work all summer. I honestly don't really know how to describe this scent. It honestly just smells really fruity and like really good and I definitely recommend it for the summertime. I also picked up my all-time favorite scent from Bath & Body Works which is Paris Amour and I just got the body cream and I also got the fragrance mist. And this is actually the only fragrance mist that I actually got on this trip to Bath & Body Works. I usually buy like a whole bunch of fragrance mists but this time I mostly just pop body creams. I actually already have a Paris Amour body cream but I decided to stock up and get another one because I'm definitely going to be using this scent all throughout summer. I'm actually gonna put some of this on right now just because my hands are like really dry at the moment. So yeah. I almost forgot to tell you guys how much this fragrance mist was on this receipt. It's saying that it was $3.95, but I honestly don't think it was that cheap. Like I honestly can't even remember. I honestly think this receipt is wrong because I don't think I could have got this for $3.95, but I don't I don't really know. Okay, so the next thing that I got is just this summertime soda pop scented candle, and this is just one of their three wick candles. And these were on sale for half off, and this was originally $24.50 and I got this for $12.25 which is definitely a good deal but it's like not the best deal and they had like a new soda line on their candles because I saw this one and I also saw another one I can't remember what the scent was but they also had a root beer float one on the back it says fragrance notes crisp lime zesty lemon and splash of soda I don't know how they can get a splash of soda in a candle but I guess they did. I could literally smell this candle all day. I think it smells like orange to me. It doesn't really smell like lemon or lime. Maybe it smells like lime a little bit. For some reason, I mostly smell orange. I think it's just because the candle's orange. Honestly, I don't know but I think this is supposed to be like an orange scented candle. And this is probably like my all time favorite thing that I got from Bath & Body Works that's in this haul video just because this candle literally smells so amazing and I'm super excited to burn it. Okay, so the next thing that I got is this Wallflower plug-in and this was originally $8.50 and I'm not even sure if this was on sale. Let me look real quick. Yeah, I don't think this was on sale, but I still got it anyways. And it's like rose gold at the top. I don't know if you guys can tell, but if you guys watched my room tour video, then you guys would know that I love rose gold. So yeah, that's why I picked out this one. And I also got some wallflower scents to go with it because I've never actually had a wallflower plug-in before. And I'm really excited because now my room's gonna smell really, really amazing. Okay, so the first scent that I got is Marshmallow Fireside. And I had to make sure whenever I checked out that this one was on sale because it is a Christmas scent. So I wasn't sure. So yeah, I got this one and I love Marshmallow Fireside. And then I also got this Honeysuckle bouquet one and I'm really excited to use this one. I'm probably going to use this one first just because this is a summer scent. And the very last one that I got is Georgia Peach and here's just what it looks like and like I said earlier I love peach scents so I'm just really excited about this. I was just looking in my bag and I realized that I forgot about this wallflower plug. I don't know how I forgot this one but I did. I guess I just didn't see it in the bag but this one is in the scent Pineapple Mango. And last but not least I did get a whole bunch of Bath & Body Works hand sanitizers and at these were on sale five for six dollars. The first one that I got is in the scent Coconut Colada and I'm really excited because I love coconut and I know a lot of people hate coconut scents but I love it. I also got this pineapple mango one and this smells really really good and also look at the packaging on these. They're like all summer themed and they're just super cute and yeah I'm really excited about this one. I also got strawberry lemon and here's just what this one looks like. I also picked up watermelon lemonade which is the same scent that I showed you guys earlier of the body cream and the shower gel and yeah I'm really excited to use this because like I said I love this scent and and the last one that I got is just a juicy watermelon and here is the packaging on this one and it just has a watermelon on it and it's super cute. So yeah, that was pretty much all for my Bath & Body Works semi-annual sale haul and I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys did then definitely give it a thumbs up for me and also subscribe to my channel if you guys are new to join the Tebe family. And if you guys want to know how much money I spent, I wasn't going to tell you guys but I decided to. I actually spent $90. It was actually $100 but I had a coupon where 
where if you spent $40 and you got $10 off. So yeah, I spent $90 here, which I know is a lot of money, but in my defense, I actually got a lot of good deals and I pretty much only go to Bath & Body Works whenever they have their semi-annual sale. Oh, I almost forgot. I do go to Bath & Body Works on Black Friday, but other than that, I don't really ever go to Bath & Body Works and buy stuff. Also, if you guys want to know what videos I'm filming and if you guys want to participate in polls like on my Instagram story, then definitely follow me on my Instagram and also follow me on my Twitter as well. I love doing polls on my Instagram story about the videos that I'm going to be doing and like asking you guys if you guys want to see a certain video because it lets me know if you guys actually want to see it or not. And yeah, I think that's pretty much all that I have to say for the outro. So I'm going to go and I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Maybe it's in the color, but I left my lover.